proxy servers masking your identity. Now, earlier in the course, we've already seen how important protecting your IP address really is. So what if you wanted to protect your IP address? What do you need to do? Now, all you need to do is, before doing absolutely anything on the internet, if you were to first connect to a proxy server, obvious question here is, what exactly is a proxy server? Now, I can think of a proxy server as something like a virtual mask. Say, for example, in the real world, if I were to wear a mask and walk down the street, very few people would be able to recognize me because the mask that I would be wearing will hide my face, which is my real identity. Similarly, on the internet, normally your computer directly communicates with systems online. As a result, all the systems with whom your computer communicates with knows your computer's IP address. However, if you were first to connect to a proxy server, which is of course a virtual mask, and then use that proxy server to communicate with other systems online, then all the systems with whom you are communicating on the internet will think that the proxy server is communicating with them, but in reality it is you who is using the proxy or hiding behind the proxy to communicate with systems online. As a result, you are able to access your favorite content, your favorite website, your favorite servers, at the same time, your IP address, your identity, your anonymity remains protected. So a proxy server basically acts as a buffer between you and the internet and hence it protects your identity. And some very good examples of proxy server software that you can actually download from the internet to convert a computer into a proxy server are First of all, if you're using Windows, then WinGate and WinProxy are excellent proxy servers. On the other hand, if you're using Unix, then Squid is a fantastic proxy server, which I like to recommend to each one of you attending this particular course. Now, these are basically examples of softwares that you can download from the internet. Just do a Google search. And once you install it on any computer, that computer becomes a proxy server and anybody on the internet which has access to that system can actually hide behind that system and start using that system to protect their IP address on the internet. Now, on the other hand, what if you wanted to connect to some other proxy server on the internet? What if you don't want to get into the hassles of setting up your own proxy server? Then all you need to do is just look at the next demonstration which I will be giving in the next section.